As a chosen land of many divine revelations, India is home to numerous holy places. Yet of them all, the nine islands of Navadweep reign supreme due to being the land of the divine appearance and pastimes of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. By the boundless mercy of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, we have come to the shelter of Om Vishnupad Sri Srila Bhakti Sindar Govinda Dev Goswami Maharaj, the self-effulgent Acharya who has returned to Navadweep Dham for the celebration of his 76th appearance day. Fully adorned with affection and mercy, he is distributing ecstasy to all sincere seekers that have come to bathe in his darshan. At the moment, the devotees are holding a press conference inside Srila Sridhar Maharaj's centenary memorial building. The international news media has just descended upon the Mott to broadcast the glories of Sri Chaitanya Saraswat Mott delivered by the leading devotees from around the world such as New York, Russia, Brazil, Mexico, California and India. After hearing the glories of Krishna consciousness, the journalists realized the spiritual value of the teachings of Srila Govinda Maharaj and joined in the kirtan. Jasamati Nandana Braja Varana Garo Jasamati Nandana Srila Govinda Maharaj is a personification of kindness and compassion, and his every move brings the greatest harmony. On this glorious day, he happily received gifts and offerings from his followers all over the world. His acceptance of our service is our greatest benefit. This is Govardhan temple, impossible. It was not our idea. But when it is revealed, manifested, I am always thinking that the Krishna, how much merciful to me. So many friends all over the world. Krishna has given me, and I am proud with their association and praising them and glorifying them. I am living. Hundreds of pilgrims gathered at the foot of the stairs awaiting His Divine Grace. The celebration began with a kirtan and was followed by the glorification of Srila Govinda Maharaj. And all the devotees we are giving a most welcome to everyone to celebrate this auspicious celebration, the Sri Puja of our Divine Spiritual Master, His Divine Grace, Srila Bhakti Sundar Govinda Dev Goswami Maharaj. He loved everyone, everyone loved him. The whole animation, not only all the people had so much affection for him, yeah, but the tree, he loved the tree, and the trees had affection for him. And even what is more inconceivable, even Rickshaw Wallace, they had affection. Most beautiful temples in Europe that produced results which Prabhupada. 
critiques. He said, in Moscow, the, the temple being on the rest square. So the temple of Gabor Dan and Radha Krishna Mahaprabhu came in the rest square. This is amazing in a country of atheism, a country where no one believes in God. Where our temple is next to KGB. On this day, the Vyasa Puja ceremony was celebrated all over the world, and those present were fortunate to personally offer Puspanjali to the lotus feet of our illustrious Guru. There is no end to the glories of this exalted personality. Srila Govinda Maharaj's mercy knows no bounds and constantly attracts pilgrims on an international level to visit and honor him. Several busloads carried pilgrims from Navadvip to Bamumpara, Srila Govinda Maharaj's birthplace. He appeared in Bamumpara where a beautiful temple has been constructed in his honor. Although appearing in a holy land distant from so-called civilization, Srila Gurudev's preaching has now spread to every corner of the world, touching the hearts of countless fortunate souls. His appearance celebration each year is a gigantic spiritual event, and thousands of guests came to pay respects, participate in kirtan, and honor prashadam. Sri Chaitanya Saraswat Mat is growing all over the world, and many want to participate in this divine Sankirtan movement. Srila Gurudev is always inspiring his devotees to become fully surrendered in Krishna consciousness. There is no limit in the life of dedication, and Srila Govinda Maharaj is able to engage everyone on any level. As always, in Navadvip Dham, he is distributing his mercy to all that are sincerely searching for Krishna Consciousness. Gurudev, I offer this garland and I am okay. ready to serve. I ask to receive Maha Mantra from me. Krishna bless you. This inspiration you have got from Sri Krishna for his divine service. I am accepting you and Divine name of Lord, I shall to you. The necessary to uh, come out from the illusory environment, and that is possible if we will practice Krishna consciousness uh, within this uh, zone, spiritual zone, then we must be super benefited and we will get relief from this material consciousness and material existence. Everybody in this world is fighting for freedom and for peace, but what is the real freedom? Freedom means, uh, Guru Maharaj said it, extended selfishness, extended selfishness everyone trying to get the ecstasy and joy and uh, the beauty and love everyone trying for this but within this material things we not will get it's permanently it is temporary some joy some uh, uh, ananda will come very temporary what is your message about love and harmony 
affection growing through love. And when love is real form getting in heart and affection growing, automatically harmony coming through that. Harmony will come through that when we can uh, embrace them with our love and affection, naturally harmony will come there. Do you have some hope for the young people in this mission? Not only hope, I have much hope and I know the new generation will build the divine temple of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu uh, with his glories and they will do that. Although we are very fallen, he has extended his mercy and given us entrance to this unique opportunity. Whenever Srila Govinda Maharaj gives initiation, he tells the devotees that he is giving this initiation on the order of his divine master, Srila Bhakti Rakak Sridhar Dev Goswami Maharaj. The relationship between Srila Govinda Maharaj and Srila Bhakti Rakak Sridhar Dev Goswami Maharaj was very intimate. His divine grace perfectly fulfills the deepest wishes of his Gurudev. He is the faithful follower on the line of Srila Rupa Goswami Prabhupada and he is a divine master of the whole creation and the gracious bestower of the seed of divine love. All of their dealings were on the pure devotional platform and countless devotees from abroad were fortunate to witness their divine relationship. Srila Govinda Maharaj developed the mat for Srila Sridhar Maharaj and was always taking care that it will grow in the proper way. Srila Govinda Maharaj embodies the pure devotion as taught by Srila Bhakti Rakak Sridhar Dev Goswami Maharaj. His life is dedicated to distributing the teachings of his guru and we are very fortunate to have his connection. As he has said many times, Krishna consciousness is a heart transaction and his merciful distribution is not limited by barriers of language, culture, distance, time, place or circumstance. Srila Govinda Maharaj has already traveled around the world more than 20 times bringing this exclusive line of devotional service to so many fortunate souls who would not otherwise have the opportunity to come to India for his personal darshan. By now, we have temples and substantial ashrams in all corners of the world. As Srila Govinda Maharaj says, the sun never sets on Sri Chaitanya Saraswat Mat. <laughs> 